And gas prices are hovering around the $5 mark just as the summer travel season is gearing up. So how is that affecting the local tourism industry? Then your size John Dowding gets answers and learns the situation may not be as bad as we think. It's easy to focus on the bad elements of the economy right now, between high prices at the pump and inflation going up. But there are some good signs, especially right here in Hampton Roads, where hotel revenues are showing no signs of stopping. With tensions remaining high on Wall Street as stocks continue to decline, a bright light, though, in our local economy is shining. The tourism industry is a bright spot. An industry that took a major hit the last two years is rebounding at record rates, especially in Hampton Roads. People are itching, really itching to get back out there and travel this summer. So we'll definitely um, see that demand for gas stay um, where it's at. And we will probably see these prices um, stay at where they are. But even as gas prices continue to rise, it's not stopping people from booking summer vacations. Hotels are on track to outperform 2021. And 2021 was a record year. So even though gas prices are biting consumers at the pump, we haven't seen traffic take a downturn yet. So gas prices aren't stopping summer vacations. They're making people choose a different destination. People are shifting their travel plans from driving across the nation, flying to Hawaii, to saying, that's a little expensive. I better stay here in Virginia. Let's go to the beach instead. If you are hitting the road this summer, there's some simple ways you can help save some gas. No excessive idling on the road, um, excessive accelerating and braking um, can also contribute to how much miles you get per gallon. Even though some people aren't canceling their summer vacation plans, they're still worried about rising prices. But experts say we shouldn't be too worried about the economy. I'll tell you why, coming up at 6 in Portsmouth. I'm John Dowding, 10 on your side.